body triangle. Really solid position for the guy on the back. He has a great deal of control over my hips. It's hard for me to turn and face him here. And for me to untie, a lot of times uh, people reach down and try to use their, their hands to untie the knot, and it can be bad news, okay? So I prefer a method that gets me out with me still having the ability to use my hands to defend here, okay? He's got the superior position, but I wanna be able to do two things at once. I wanna protect my neck and untie this knot. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna lean to the side. A lot of people like the foot lock here, but some people just don't feel it. I can put a lot of pressure and it's just not gonna feel it. Sometimes the foot's just pinned to the floor really, really well. And to really put extra pressure, I have to reach down with my hands and push the knee. It's bad news. I wanna protect my neck. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my top leg I, to get rid of the hook first. I push that down and I'm gonna get my leg flat. Once the leg is on the ground, I'm gonna pull this out a little bit so I have access to it. My top leg's gonna come over and I press down. So this is a lot like a shrimp crawl, but I'm keeping my pressure on his foot. I'm not posting on the floor, I'm posting on the foot. I want to keep that there. Now I move my hips back to untie his figure four. Once it's unlocked, I slide this knee through. I keep the pressure on the foot. I don't want to let go here because he'll readjust on the opposite side. That's bad news. So I want to keep that there, move my hips out, slide the knee through, and now I'm out of this position. I'm still in danger, but at least I've untied this knot. I push the leg down, get my leg flat. Now I can draw this out. He still has the lock. It's still controlling my hips really well. So what I want to do is push this foot down, put my weight on it, and now I move my hips back to untie this. So my hips are pushing his legs open here. So now that he's lost this hook, and it keep my foot here so he can't readjust the triangle on the opposite side. So now I'm going to slide this through, turn. Now I've got to deal with whatever comes next, but at least I've untied this knot. So give it a try.